All right, so now we're here at pressing. You may find um, when you look at your piece that there might be some little bubbles here and here. Um, that can sometimes happen if this piece was stretched out a little bit and it's really not a big deal. All that I do in that case is just do a quick press right here and that just seems to ease the fabric back into place so that um, those bubbles uh, don't remain. Now I designed um, this block so that this outer piece of fabric had a tighter slope than this inner piece of fabric which means that that um, this circle will just gently kind of lay right on top of um, the outer piece. And I, um, I like that feature in the pattern because even if your stitches are wonky, they're not going to be seen because the fabric is kind of overlapped. You'll sometimes uh, run into a curved piecing pattern where um, it's almost like the stitches are exposed and uh, you can see really clearly all of your stitches because one circle fits right inside of the other but I like it this way so yes you can see um, what I did I just laid this down flat and uh, and pressed this flat and there's not really even a lip here it just kind of just rests right on top of the stitches um, so yes, that's what uh, you need to think about when you're pressing. And next we'll be doing trimming.